Good morning, everyone. Welcome to day 22 of one month in my bullet journal. This is Krista from Simply Breathe Now. So yesterday went totally um, kiwashed, really. <laughs> I did my morning as expected, and then um, apparently the buses were canceled. I had no idea. The roads were perfectly clean and fine, but the night before we had this so-called ice storm, and so they canceled... Um, all rural buses which included us so I ended up taking the kids to school which also meant I had to pick them up so that caused a whole bunch of stuff to go pear-shaped but when we get to the daily plan you'll see what I mean and so we'll get right into our collection pages um, okay so yesterday um, if I can spell impromptu I think so <laughs> I think that's how you spell it, impromptu. Dinner, we, um, I picked one of the kids' friends up from school because they also had a bus cancellation and, and he's on our way home. And so the parents said, hey, why don't you stay for dinner? Which was awesome, really fun. I love that. We used to do that all the time in Dubai. We would just have, Someone would be walking by our door and we're like, hey, stay for dinner. And they would. <laughs> and it was so fun. So I absolutely love doing that. It doesn't happen very often here, partly because we live out in the country, but also I just find everybody needs to plan a bit more ahead. And they have the, um, I don't know if it's a feeling of, well, if I stay, then I should give back instead of just everybody has to eat. Let's eat together. So... I so love when that happens and it was awesome and the kids were just over the moon excited. Okay, I was up at five yesterday. No exercise, I really need to exercise. I'm feeling so sluggish. My legs honestly feel like they're craving a run and I know people are thinking that's probably insane but they really do crave running. Good day, good day, connect with Jeff. Um, no, I didn't see him for over 12 hours. Longer than that. I didn't even see him. We talked on the phone a bit, but not really. Goal check. Uh, yes. Half hour kid time. Yeah, we did. Post to Instagram. Did that.
Okay, so my phone just stopped or my video just stopped and I checked what the word was for how to spell spontaneity. It was full. I hadn't deleted all of my videos yet. So I just did that and now we are rocking and rolling again. So the universe definitely wanted me to put spontaneity because it wanted me to check how to spell it. <laughs> so there we go. Thank you, universe. The EI at the end is what I did not have for spontaneity. I would not have put that in there. All right, I'm not even gonna blacken it. I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm loving this new pen. I love the thickness of it. Okay, oops, sorry. <clears throat> so my sleep, I was in bed early. I would, all of a sudden, even though I had a great night last night or the night before, 7.30, I was done. So I was trying to read and at eight o'clock I had to turn my light out. I could not, <coughs> <coughs> excuse me, not stay awake at all. So I was in bed, um, the same, no, half an hour more. And I had a great sleep until two o'clock and then I was wide awake. And then at three, my little one woke up. Needed a hug and a kiss. <laughs> okay, so eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, one, two, six hours. And technically I was only up once. I was just laid awake for all of it. And I hate then when I'm up that early in the morning because then when I just kind of, I usually fall asleep around 3.34 and then all of a sudden the alarm goes off and you're like, oh, that just sucks because all of a sudden you didn't sleep all that. I kind of feel better. I don't know why if it, if it's, I wake up earlier in the night and then I, if I, even if I lay there, then I have a bit more sleep, I guess, after. But when it's three o'clock, it's always doomsday. I always feel like five o'clock is so early, <laughs> but I get up anyways. Um, I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, let's go to the day. <clears throat> okay, we have beautiful sunshine. Roads were clear. It was gorgeous. Um, I didn't do my Pete's notes. I did the groceries and I went to the post office and I did my clients. I didn't do my Pete's notes. I didn't have a chance to print the scale off or do anything really at home. I didn't didn't even sit at my computer other than to do the edi editing of my video, which has, I haven't even checked to see if it's uploaded yet. Um, the Hydro Bill, they sent me a notice. It's due in three days. So that's good because I was wondering, I'm like, I'm pretty sure I have to contact Jamie about her journals that she wants and Val's workshop I have to sign up for. And then I did add this. Buses were canceled. Didn't find out until five minutes after they're supposed to be picked up. My daughter's like, maybe the buses are canceled. I'm like, why? And then I checked it and they were <laughs> I was like, there's no reason to. Um, but I could smell the earth um, yesterday. It was so awesome. I'm like, oh, it was warming up. I should add the weather. It was three degrees and minus four. It was so lovely yesterday. I considered putting on a spring jacket. But the wind was still very northy, so it was very cold, the wind. And then we had dinner at our friend's house, which was just so great and fun and totally unexpected. Those are fun days. <clears throat> okay, Friday, 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 Friday. And this has ended up being a really busy day too. I thought it would be not, but it is. 20 second. And it was today. Grateful. I actually didn't do my learner intention one at the beginning. Oh, I'm all over the place today. Thrown off. Oh, 
Okay. And we were going to have a pretty relaxed weekend. And then, of course, I went and threw in some play dates with some friends. So now it's a bit busy. But that's good for the kids to have. Play dates. We don't have them enough, I don't think. You can't have your house full of people if you don't invite them over. <laughs> In this, it appears. So, gotta invite them over. And I need to go back and do this because I forgot. I feel and radiate pure love in my soul and to all those around me. And today I am grateful for all that is coming to me. In a place of abundance. All right, back to Friday. So we have um, an appointment this morning, my daughter. And I really want to do, get my pelvic floor client stuff sorted. I'm um, I pretty much have a plan, but I just want to sit down for maybe an hour and PT client and just kind of really go over what my plan is. And since it is my first assessment, I kind of want to have a better idea of review the assessment form and just kind of <clears throat> look at it and make sure I have all my handouts ready and my explanations um, rolling off my tongue and I'm not stuck trying to figure out how to explain it. So I really want a client um, prep is what I'm going to put. Okay, and then let's do some stuff here. I did do the groceries. Thursday we had takeout pizza. We never have takeout pizza just because we can't or delivery um, out here just it would be cold by the time it gets out here and it's just I always make pizza and my daughter is like are we gonna have takeout pizza like real takeout like you're not gonna make it she was so excited <laughs> oh it's so funny I remember being the same when people would get cookies, store-bought cookies in their lunch. And I'd be like, oh, may I have one? Instead of homemade cookies. Um, okay. Oh. Back over here. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Keep hitting the camera today. We are um, having a play date, 1230. Here. And then hopefully my daughter's friend responds and says she can come. And so I am hoping that we can have dinner with my mom and dad again. So and I'm going to basically just put tie up loose ends for the week meaning all of these things so February posts I have to just finish making a few of those posts to Etsy not sure I'll be able to get to that but then I do need to write my note before I forget from yesterday's home visit and then just tidy up some of the stuff I don't think I'll be doing my books but these two all little things so that's my plan is just to kind of tie up any loose ends this afternoon. Um, <clears throat> this morning is going to be a bit hard because I dropped the kids off 8.30. Then we have an hour and a half for the appointment and then drop her off at 11.30 and then I have another hour and a half. I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, maybe <clears throat> I know what I'm going to do in that time. Because there's no point for me driving home and then driving back into town because it takes 
20 minutes to half an hour to do that one way drive so I'd only be home for half an hour so I think I'm gonna go to I have to go back to the grocery store because I picked up the groceries yesterday but they forgot oranges and I forgot to get plain yogurt so back to the grocery store and I need to go to the bulk barn all right so bulk barn <coughs> And get a few things from there and right beside the bulk barn is a dollar store and we broke one of our containers and that seems to be from the dollar store here it was from Dubai originally but they stock it in the dollar store here so that's cool so I'll go to the dollar store so I'll do that around this appointment and picking up my son for nursery so get all those errands oh in the bank there's a paycheck so I can go to the bank um, and I think that's it. So that'll be good. Very good. And then when I get home from drop, picking my son up from nursery, um, <clears throat> I can do that prep during nap time to contact my mom and dad and then do up any of these loose ends before going for dinner. And something else just came into my head. <clears throat> Jeff is going to do um, move, I don't know what to say, I guess furniture. In our Amy's house, we it was left with a whole bunch of, well, the house and barn and lot was pretty much full with everything, <laughs> junk and some good stuff. So the good stuff, the furniture that we found that we love, we've had in what they would call the dining room we didn't know where else to put it but now that we're actually going to start gutting the house we're going to move it to the loft of the barn which we've now made a floor for and so they're doing that on saturday so that's good okay um and i think that is it good 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 busy day Hope you're all having a great Friday and I will see you tomorrow for the weekend. Bye.